Hello and welcome back everyone. In today's video we are going to upload some assets. Yes, assets. Here I have a folder that has some assets, four of them, you only need one. And I also have a picture of the asset that I'm going to upload. Beautiful, isn't it? I don't suggest you upload a cube because it's boring. Upload something more interesting so I can use it. Anyway, so these are the things that we're going to be uploading and we are going to upload them directly to the asset catalog. If you don't know what the asset catalog is, you basically go to create.highrise.game and here you go to asset catalog and this is the catalog that you can upload assets to. Here you can basically just select an asset and download it and it can also be done inside the Highrise Studio itself. So if you go back to Unity and in this project, if I go to Highrise and then Studio and then Asset Catalog, you can see here there are a bunch of different assets that I can choose from, whether it's structure landscape, furniture, lights, vehicles, and everything else. You basically download and drag and drop it in the scene. So if you have an asset and you want to upload it to everyone to use, you just follow the steps. So first things first, we go to the creator portal, which is creator high res game. You sign in, enter your username and password. Once you sign in, go to dashboard, go to creation, and then assets, and create an asset. Now here, give your asset a name. I am going to call it the same name as the cube that I have. So now that's done, select a category, I'm going to do structure and create draft. Now that's done, simple and easy. Give your asset a description, for example, I'm going to say basic brown wood wedge. And add a keyboard, cube, wood, anything you want. And you can also upload an image. I'm going to upload the same image that I was using and I'm going to set it here. You can also do this in the high-rise studio. Upload an image for the thumbnail and you should be good to go. But wait, we don't have asset. No assets found. And you can upload this using the high rise studio. So let's go back to Unity. Now, back in Unity, if I go to project and go to template and my assets, I already have the asset right here. So let's say I want to upload or add an asset into this scene. So I basically go to the asset that I have, which is right here. And I basically drag and drop this. And then this is the asset that we're going to upload. I already have it here with materials and everything. So I'm going to delete this and I'm going to choose this. Now, there's one node here that you, you have to check. If you select the cube itself and you go to the project, which is, for example, this one right here, and you go to the inspector panel and the model, scroll all the way down and click on generate light map UVS. Enable that and hit apply. This will enable you to generate maps or light maps based on the cube itself. That's done. Simple and easy. Go to lighting. In the mesh render, if you want to change the material, you can do it. And go to lighting, set cast shadows off or on, up to you. And then enable contribute global illumination and set it to light maps. Now, go to the cube itself, right click, find export high res asset, click on it. And here, you can give it a name and you can select a category from here. Instead, you can choose the basic brown wood wedge, which is the one that we just created. And you can update the image. Now, if you update the image, it will take the image from, the, from here. But... I will stick to the image that I have. So I'm going to uncheck this and I'm going to say upload. Once that's done, this will direct you to the asset that you just created. Now, there's an asset link here. If you click on it, this will basically download the asset and it will show you the folder that contains the asset. And then you can double check if the asset is basically working or not. And I forgot to do something. I forgot to save after I did the description and the keyword. So you have to do that. I'm going to do it again. And actually, the name of the asset is wrong. It's not wedge. So I'm going to change it. And just set this as a description and say here brown, say wood, say cube, say block, whatever you want and save it. Now that's done. You can basically publish the assets and the asset will be reviewed by the support team. If there's any issue with the asset, it will be rejected. So publish. And now you just wait for us to review the asset for you. And that's it. Now, if you want to create your own asset, you can do it on Blender. We can do it whatever you want, even in game itself, in, in Unity itself. But just make sure that you look up YouTube tutorial on how to create assets to make them look unique and something that people might be interested in. And uh, that's all for today. I hope you guys upload more assets to the asset catalog so everyone can use them. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you.